major winter storm Piper has already become a historic winter storm along the West Coast. Widespread heavy rainfall across California is bringing the threat of flooding in the Los Angeles area on Friday. Extremely heavy snowfall in the mountains along with hurricane force winds has prompted blizzard warnings in portions of the mountainous terrain in California for the first time in 30 years. This very dangerous storm will not stop in California though. As the system crosses through the southwest over the weekend, it will re-emerge east of the Rockies, spawning a potentially major outbreak of severe weather over portions of the southern plains on Sunday afternoon into the evening. After that, it will quickly advance northeast, bringing widespread heavy rainfall and strong winds to the Midwest. When it runs into cold air over the upper Midwest and Great Lakes, freezing rain and heavy snow will break out on Monday across the region. On Monday night into Tuesday, snowfall may begin across the Northeast, including areas that haven't seen much snow this winter. Snow will continue for the Northeast throughout the entire day, as it slowly slides eastward. The snowfall should move out of the country by Wednesday. It's still too early to look at how much snow or ice we are expecting in the upper Midwest, Great Lakes, and Northeast, but here's a quick update on the snow for the Southwest. Extremely heavy snowfall accumulations are still expected for the mountainous terrain in central and southern California, primarily southern areas of the Sierras and the San Gabriel Mountains. Heavy snow will spread across the mountains in Nevada, Arizona, Colorado, Utah, and New Mexico as the storm moves inland over the weekend. An abnormally warm pattern over the eastern half of the country will keep precipitation mainly rain for much of the Midwest and Ohio Valley. Instead of seeing widespread snowfall in areas that normally do during the winter, it's looking much more like a widespread heavy rainfall event. According to the Weather Prediction Center, the heaviest rain is expected from central Oklahoma northward into the Ohio Valley and Great Lakes region. A corridor of potentially even heavier rain may set up from the Kansas City area up into Wisconsin. This is possible since weather model guidance is suggesting that the low-pressure center will move through this area, bringing with it heavy rainfall. When the storm hits colder air from northern Minnesota down into the northeast, freezing rainfall and snow will develop as the moisture pushes into the colder air. Here is a map I created showing where I think any type of wintry weather is possible between Monday morning to Wednesday afternoon associated with winter storm Piper. Wintry precipitation will be possible from northern Minnesota down through parts of Michigan and into the northeast, maybe even as far south as New York City. This darker blue layer represents where I think wintry precipitation, whether it's snow, freezing rain, or sleet, will be likely. This color extends from northern Minnesota through northern Michigan, and into parts of the northeast. We are also expecting a severe weather event from this storm, beginning on Sunday afternoon. The severe weather risk looks to be pretty significant on Sunday, especially from northern Texas into southern Kansas. The primary risks with these severe storms look to be damaging winds and large hail, but multiple tornadoes, some of which may be strong, are also possible. The severe threat will likely continue eastward on Monday, with the primary threat area extending from extreme northern portions of Georgia into eastern Kentucky. I think that the risk of damaging winds may become the dominant threat by this point, especially because these storms will likely develop into a squall line. Even though damaging winds may become the main threat, some isolated large hail and even a few tornadoes could remain possible. Thank you for watching today's video. If you enjoyed this weather forecast and you would like to see more, please consider subscribing to this channel with the notification bell on, so you never miss out when new updates are released. Thank you, and see you soon.